Leck and Greg Vegan Camp, the 1st of January 2023. Happy New Year! Fabian has a new hat too. Mm. And get me work, my to the orchard, my. And also a new shirt. <laughs> Started painting the trees with limestone and some of the powder, not powder post beetles, the mango stem borers also also bore into other trees like the jackfruit trees. So when you mix the, the limestone it mixed with some of the poo or something from the these bugs makes them uh, look like we're painting them pink color. Oh, maybe that one is ripe soon. And some mango trees are in really bad shape because of the mango stem borers. But it seems like some of the fungi we have been using and also together with the limestone they might survive, but otherwise some trees need to be cut down completely. And this year it seems like we will get mangoes, because when they look like this and they have like the, the stem with the small mangoes, it's uh, pink, it's, it looks healthy. And we have more over there, so as long as we get a couple of mangoes per tree, that's fine. Drying some beans. Fabian is uh, picking the last chilies of this season maybe the thing is if we water them they will they will they will give again they will give more fruit like it's watering the plants and all the infected branches from the mango trees we can burn in a controlled environment in those barrels to turn them into charcoal or just into dust many of the banana plants have been infected with worms so Fabian has been doing a great job of taking care of the bananas, cutting them down and putting them into the banana graveyard, banana plant graveyard. Lime season is a little, little bit low, so, but we have a lot of sour tamarind, so that's great. Still have a couple of limes on the trees, so that's good. And the newly planted banana forest is still alive. Also pretty excited about this setup where we have the payas growing very nearby the the red cavendish so it's exciting because I've never seen papayas grow so close or and it's not these were not planted deliberately so it's exciting to see if they will survive and how they will grow together just so nearby a banana. But I guess they will they will grow well. Let's see what happens. And of course, mulberry season is coming up. The last of the passion fruits are also dropping and I think the season will be over soon. And this dome is not able to sustain itself anymore, so it will probably be removed soon.